Hey everyone, so this moment I will show you how to cover uh, uh, spectral indices, you know, in our engine. So I'm using simple to imagery here, you know, uh, to uh, with 10 meter resolution. Uh, so I create a composite, uh, first I cut most of the image, then I create a composite based on the date I want and the area I want, which is okay, from thermal geometry. And it's the image I show you using the near uh, short wave infrared and blue composite so that you can see the pages this in red orange while the the green one mean the is a city could be or a bare land and the blue one is water uh for me uh to make easier to cover in this is you need to create a band map band map basically is a instruction you give to the uh, calculation that which band is used for each uh, variable in the formula. For example, for blue, it's supposed to be image uh, from band 2, you know, band 2 of the image, and green mean is image uh, band 3, and for mirror infrared is uh, band 8, and for sweat, also of infrared 1 is uh, band 11. So I have to divide it by the way. So the, uh, the, they already know which image to use for this calculation. First, I'm going to work at NVI, you know, so let's try and run again uh, to show you what it looks like. So this is NVI. Where I use a uh, near minus red uh, per near plus red using the normal indices, you know, from this formula uh, from this Lancet uh, USGS website. When 5 means big 4, which is, you know, near plus near minus, minus red, uh, divided by uh, near plus per red. So, results the green part means that it's half high in VI, and blue one is not. Well, white is like in between. And also try to do uh, a VI or inspection index, you know more advanced uh, indices for outside imagery uh, for failure uh, indices I mean it's just the results so the value is more uh, difference because in API you, they try to uh, factor in kind of density so the, the, the area which have a lower vegetation uh, have higher vegetation can be shown here higher than here like there is no contrast between low and high vegetation so that's the function of API also, I can also calculate a uh, noise water index, you know, which is to calculate water. So I use this uh, below formula, green minus near and green plus near, or difference. Uh, this is the result. Where uh, blue mean is water, red mean is not water. So it's very simple. Like, so you can calculate, like, show which is water, which is not. Uh, also, you can calculate uh, NBI, which is to index, which is to calculate building or bare, bare area, which is where if there is a red here, then that is a building or a bare area, like this one. So no vegetation or, or water. We can also have uh, VI or enhanced mangrove green index for mangrove. Basically, this is basically is vegetation that have a high water content, you know, such as wetland, etc. Just so that uh, if area have wet there, wet and have vegetation, it have a high value. Uh, if you move the image, let's say to the coast, you can see that more clearly. Let's say change here to see mangrove index, right? See, so mangrove, uh, this part, which is the green one, is more in hand, right? You can see that the different mangrove and water and other other vegetation because mangrove is wet and have high vegetation values. So yeah. So this is how you create um, this is in your engine, for example, way, get a band map, and do expression, etc. And you're done. Bye. Good luck.